Now, there is a sad note in the world of sports. Sad for many of us, of course, here at ABC. We lost a true friend. Jimmy Jacobs, the co-manager of heavyweight boxing champion Mike Tyson, died Wednesday of pneumonia following a nine-year battle with leukemia. Jimmy was 57 years old. He was a very special person we remember so well. We also remember him as a world-class athlete. He was considered the world's greatest handball player, winning every match he played, singles and doubles, from 1955 to 1969. But his real passion was boxing. Together with partner Bill Caton, he owned films and tapes of more than 17,000 fights dating back to the 1890s. Jacobs also managed fighters like Wilfred Benitez, a former three-time champion, and Edwin Rosario, a former lightweight champion. And it was his longtime friendship with the late Customato, the legendary fight trainer that led Jacobs to Mike Tyson. Yesterday in Los Angeles, Mike Tyson and the rest of the boxing world said goodbye to Jimmy Jacobs. Jimmy had many friends here at ABC. We knew him as a warm, caring, and intensely loyal friend. We all will miss him.